10, the first legal challenge to Hawaii's new concealed carry gun ban is set to be heard tomorrow in federal court. Gun rights activists are suing the state and Maui County. Our Eddie Dowd has new reaction in tonight's top story. Three Maui gun owners and the Hawaii Firearms Coalition filed a lawsuit on June 23rd, hoping to block the new sensitive locations law, which is set to take effect statewide on July 1st. Hawaii is one of the most restrictive states in the country, and they're proud of it. The Hawaii Firearms Coalition is taking aim at the state's sensitive places law, which bans guns in most public areas, including beaches, hospitals, stadiums, movie theaters, and bars that serve alcohol. 77 pages worth of limitations. It covers a lot of ground. Um, a lot of it is having to do with restricting people with permits so that they basically can't carry anywhere except in their house. Their house and gun ranges. That was the intent when the state and several counties enacted the law after the U.S. Supreme Court broadened gun rights last summer. Writing for the conservative majority, Justice Clarence Thomas said gun laws must be comparable to what founding fathers wrote. They basically have to be able to tie whatever law they're passing to some thing from 1791. Meantime, the counties of Maui and Honolulu have been issuing more concealed carry permits since the high court's ruling. MPD okayed more than 100. HPD approved more than 220. But the new sensitive places laws allows businesses to decide if guns are allowed on their premises. The Back Alley Cafe in Makiki has a zero tolerance policy. We want them to be relaxed, get that weight off their shoulders a little bit. That's the job of our bartending. So, so they leave better, not scared because somebody has a weapon. Maui County told us in a statement it's evaluating the lawsuit and working with the state. The state was unable to provide a response to Hawaii News Now. Other states are facing similar lawsuits. Last week, a New Jersey court allowed a new gun ban to go in effect pending appeal. California recently strengthened its law to avoid legal challenges. Attorneys in the Hawaii case are confident and are digging in for the long haul. So this could take years before we get a decision? Absolutely. It can certainly take a couple of years. And I suspect it will. Tomorrow's hearing is scheduled for 10 a.m. in U.S. District Court before Judge Leslie Kobayashi. Eddie Dowd, Hawaii News Now. Thank you, Eddie.